Hello everyone, welcome back to Subsistence. This morning we are just going on a bit of a cougar hunt. Um, the recurve bow, the level 4 needs repaired, so this is why I don't really use it a lot. It's 2 rope, which is 6 sinew, 4 adhesive, and 6 scrap. And this is only about a little uh, under half damage. But there we are, we have our level 4 recurve bow. I do have everything in the base turned off. Our BCU says that eventually we should be okay with the power coming in and going out. I want to get out and do a bit of cougar hunting. I would like to start on some of the furniture that we do need for the base today. Or not really today, but I need to get the material today to start on that. So, um,. I am going to be looting, of course, as always. I do have my double barrel shotgun, which I forgot to repair, but I think will be okay. I did also bring the pump shotgun, just in case I get myself in sort of a bind and forget to reload the double barrel shotgun. That has happened several times already. Um, hopefully we can get up here. We shouldn't have an issue today hopefully we won't uh, I did bring the level 4 bow it's probably one of the silliest things that I could do is bring this particular bow but I really wanted to have as much um, hit point damage as possible to these guys they are very very scary to me I always seem to have an issue with them uh, with killing them it's very difficult for me. I don't mind them so much after I see them, but it is the finding them part that's the problem. There's a level one wolf over there. The cougar probably won't be on this side of the water. However, um, I don't want to Run, run into the wolf. I don't like dealing with those guys when I am on a specific mission. Okay, we are officially in cougar country now. Or what I call cougar country. Up near the snow line is always a good place to spot the cougar. Um, really hope we can find it very early. Is that it? Way over there? Nope, that's plant fiber. I don't see it up here in the snow. There's a plant fiber over here. Usually like right on this ridge is where it is. Um, we have seen it a lot down in the grass as of late. So maybe it's down here a bit. I don't really know. I just wanted to get the plant fiber since I was already in this area. Um, if we have to stay at the outpost, it'll give us a chance to check on the meat down there and see if it did spoil. Hopefully it didn't. Hopefully those two upgraded solar panels were enough to keep it going. I don't even hear the cougar up here. Definitely don't see it. Okay, let's keep looking.
think I see it now. I think that would be it right there. The gun is loaded. It is level one. Should really only take one shotgun round. And that it did. Let's reload this gun. Uh, reload. Number one and butcher. We only got four pieces of sinew from this one. But four is better than none. Okay, let's get over where the other cougar generally hangs out. This one is always the hardest one to find. Scrap! Just walking over where the other cougar hangs out. Hopefully we can find it easily today. Uh, don't expect that. It's never an easy one to find for me. There has been one instance where it was really, really easy. There's a piece of scrap over here. Have a little look around here. Let's go over on this kind of lookout point. There's a wolf over there. That's not the cougar. not underneath us. There's a bear over there. I could potentially not be far enough around the mountain. I have found it right in this area before. Get up on this rock and have a little look. I don't even hear it. There's some birds flying overhead. Okay, so we have just spotted the cougar. There's some scrap here. I was not far enough around the mountain. This one's level two. We could potentially take the two rounds. I'm going to try to do this slowly enough that hopefully I can get it in one shot. That was excellent. I would have used both rounds if I would have needed those. We got five this time, which is nice. Let's reload the shotgun. I think I'll hold off a bit on washing my hands. Um, just because there is generally another cougar very, very close to that one. So 
sometimes I do have trouble finding this one also. There's a wolf down there. There's no cougar here. I think it's generally over by that big tree. This is one of the places where more often than not, I do die. So I fully expect that this time. Okay, I don't see a cougar. I don't hear a cougar. I do hear the wind. Barber's nice. A bunny rabbit is scary. A wolf usually means we're in the area. Maybe I'm a little bit too high up on the hillside for the cougar. Maybe it's a bit lower down. Can you let me have a little bit closer look down this way? See if I can get down here and wash my hands. I do think I'm a bit too far around the mountain now for the cougar. Okay, let me look again. Um, I do have water on me. It's not a huge deal. There's a brown bear just there. I honestly don't hear the cougar. Is that it right up there? if we can kill it. We did find it. It was right where I originally thought it was, right by that big tree. Okay, let's go ahead and butcher him. We're going to wash our hands this time and probably have a protein bar and a couple of berries. Maybe this carrot just to get it out of our inventory. <clears throat> we'll even have a second protein bar. There's a crate up here that I want to get. shotgun round. Very nice, which uh, reminds me to reload the shotgun, the double barrel. Probably going to need to do that. 
We're at 14 sinew. We're going to need a lot of it. There's a crate here. Let's continue um, looking for cougars. Pretty likely we'll find at least one more today. Hopefully anyway. chicken let's go down a bit further into sort of the flatter area down here more often than not where we find the cougar. I think that's it right there. one is a level three which will mean most likely two shots uh, we got three four five six pieces of sinew from this one which is nice there can potentially be another one down here close to this pond area. But let's get down here and wash our hands um, regardless of what we find down here. Okay, let's head back up this direction. we see we do see a bear we see a chicken that's not too scary we see a crate up that way we see a man that is very scary he's just running over this way Didn't know where he was, and he is kicking my butt. Okay, you can stop being so rude to me, sir. I guess I'll have a bandage. Stop the bleeding. So they could potentially have killed a cougar over here. I do assume he's not alone. Doesn't sound like it. Sounds like they're fighting with something over in this direction. There's the cougar up on the hillside. Just want to get these couple of crates if possible. There's one more here.
I'm gonna have to use a health kit to get my health back up to normal. Two, three, four, five pieces here. We've got 25 pieces so far. We do know that there are rogues in this area somewhere. Because we did kill one of them. There should also be another cougar in this area. Again, unless it has been killed by something. I'm not quite sure how many that makes. Five, maybe? Six? I'm not sure. Five, probably. Let's see if we can get over here and wash our hands. not sure if I did miss a cougar down this way. I do know where the rogue camp is. I do know that's a level 3 cougar. That has been damaged. I assume it didn't start out as a level 3 cougar. Mm, there was a crate somewhere over here I do think I saw. An ammo crate. Um, let's see. The best approach here. I guess just deal with it level three but it doesn't have a lot of hit points probably could take it out with the bow but I'm a little bit of afraid to do that so let's see if we can just hit it and get it coming our direction if that was all of them or not that did make I think number six um, that's a record for us let's hope we can get over to the outpost without any issue would love to get the sinew back to the base I don't think we can make it back to the base today it is starting to get dark um, so we might just spend the night at the outpost and then hurry back home um, I probably won't even record going back home simply because um, I'll just be leaving at the first sign of daylight and just running straight back there just to um, you know get back there with the sinew I don't want to lose any of this I assume that um, the rogue was headed down to the pond to do some fishing. He probably just narrowly escaped the rogues. I should have looked for bags there. I didn't take the time. It is getting dark. Um, I assume that the cougar, you know, didn't start at level three. Um, it did look like he had taken some damage. Probably was maybe a level one or two and then killed someone or something. There's a deer over here. Oh dear. There's a bear down here. There's a great potential for a locked crate. Close to the water's edge. 
There's also a great potential of me running out of stamina and dying because of a wolf chasing me. I probably should go ahead and reload this. There's another wolf. Stamina's getting very, very low. Almost there. I do think we've made it finally. Yay! Let's put this away. Let's check the fridge. Let's see if it's still running. I did have something. I have eaten a liver times one. That was a complete accident. Um, yeah. The power is still going. We have full power here. Which is very nice. Um, not complaining at all about that. Let's have a drink of water. Let's also have a tomato or two to get ourselves topped up. Let's go ahead and get some water um, cooking. The fire should be okay. Let's go ahead and ignite that. Let's put away a few things here. The cloth away down here. Ammo stuff over here. And um, I'm going to take the seed back with me. The fat. I'm going to leave it in here. And the potassium. I guess I can take it back with me. There's not really a need for it down here. I'm going to go ahead and harvest these tomatoes and get another bed planted just to have them down here. And get that done. put the water over here in case we need it through the night, which is possible. Um, let's go ahead and turn this on since we are here and just let it refine whatever it can refine at the moment. And we'll turn on the generator just to help out with power through the night. Well, maybe we will, won't need it. Maybe the solar panels are doing that great of a job. Um, the Refinery isn't really doing or using a lot of power. Um, there is some upgrades. There's not really... Well, there is one increased power efficiency. I do need to make another mass storage for that one. But I can make that the other base and bring it down here. Super, super excited that the fridge is still going. But anyway, guys, I'm just going to do a little bit of things around this base um, just because we haven't been down here in a while. And I want to thank you so much for hanging out with me today. I really do appreciate all of your support on this channel and on this series as well. I hope you enjoyed this episode. I hope you're looking forward to future episodes. I can't wait to catch you guys in the next one. Until then, have yourselves a wonderful, wonderful day.